all right guys i'm gonna show you today what i got from the calgary expo 2022 and uh, let's start with uh, funko pop michael jordan uh, number 74 i got this for i believe uh 25 dollars or 20 dollars then of course i also found a michael jordan number 84 funko pop for 30 dollars that's canadian and then i got myself a superman number 85 and this was just 17 dollars good deal hey and then another superman funko pop figure for just 16 dollars it's really nice to buy uh in the comic expo because the prices are really good uh, compared to regular retail prices right and then i found another superman this one is number 83 it's black and white right there uh, this one is or was just 20 dollars next item i'll show you is well, another superman this one I got for $20. I was told by the retailer that they they put the wrong price on it, but then they have to order the $20 uh, tag that, that's on the box right now. This one is number 130, False God Superman. He said this is supposed to uh, retail for like $50, but I got a good bargain because of the wrong tagging there. And then I also got a Superman, number 1123. And this one was, I think it's also $20. I didn't really, you know, I can't remember the price, but I believe this was just $20, either $20 or $25. Then I also got myself another Superman figure, $114, and this was just $18. My wife was actually telling me to buy more, but then I don't want to, I don't want to spend too much. And then I got myself, because uh, Goku is one of my favorite characters um, in the comic world. And this one is Dragon Ball Z 615. And Goku was just $16. And I don't want to collect uh, other characters aside from Michael Jordan, Goku, or Superman. Because that's going to start my collect collection again. Oh, I need two hands to get this out. Excuse me, guys item I got was a Michael Jordan 10 inch uh, Funko Pop and this is number 75 and it's just $70 and that's it and in this bag I have well, this are Alexis stuff well I got myself a Superman multi-universe right there this just came out like a week ago and the guy selling it just was just selling it for $15. I should have bought more from him because he had a really good uh, bargain but no, I don't want to spend too much as I said. Then I got another Superman multiverse. This one is where he is wearing a black uh, costume, black cape from the movie. This was also $15. Then another uh, Marvel Legend figure for me. This was $20. This is Thor, I mean Odinson. Or Odin, I mean. And then I got uh, another Superman Black. And this was $15 also from the DC Multiverse. There we go. Another new one in the box. It's another, it's a Legends, Marvel Legends figure. It's uh, the AIM Scientist Supreme. $20 also, I mean 15 yeah, really good price. I got I got myself some loose figures here. I got this uh, Superman figure right there. And I think it was just uh, like $10. Yeah. I got myself another Superman figure right here for another $10. third superman figure we just said turn around so that right there it's a superman steel figure 
another ten dollars. That's it. So these are all I've got from the Comic Expo, Calgary Comic Con, um, 2022. All right. Again, the Legends, the Funko Pops, right there. Superman, Goku, Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan, Superman, DC Multiverse, uh, new in the box, and some Superman loose figures. I believe I spent, I believe, if my computation is correct and my memory is correct, I, I spent like $375 for all these figures. Plus I had fun, and you know, spend time with the family so we're going to go to that next comic convention which will be held in Edmonton north of Red Deer all right so see you there again thanks for watching the videos guys and hope you guys subscribe thank you again and have a great day stay safe bye bye